Wentworth is a great place to study computer information systems because we're setting students up that understand technology. So we have students that decide that they want to be technical for a few years after they graduate. We have other students that decide they want to go sort of in that in-between route. They want to be a business analyst or a project manager, so they understand the technology, but they also understand the business side of it, so they can be sort of that interpreter, figure out what the business really needs and then how to translate that into technology. What we do at Wentworth is our students go out on two co-ops. These are really key, especially for CIS students, because about half of our students actually get hired out from their co-ops. And they have a choice. Do they want to continue working for the company they worked for for three months? Or did they not really love it and they want to go work somewhere else? Also, our students, because they have all that business knowledge, they don't have to worry about the Peter Principle. So the Peter Principle means that you will be promoted to your level of incompetence. So think about a programmer. They take no business classes. So they get promoted now maybe to be an IT manager. Now they're asked to do budgets, a deal with finance. They're asked to sell things, maybe market themselves, and they have none of those skill sets. And worse, they don't know how to manage people. They don't know how to lead or inspire people because they were never taught that in school. So a programmer would then need to go out and get an MBA. Well, a CIS major already has all those business classes. So even if you decide to go technical, when you get promoted, the Peter Principle is no longer in play because you've taken accounting, you've taken finance, you've taken a marketing class, you've taken a management class, and now you're more promotable than someone that is a straight technologist. When you compare the different disciplines of computing, What's different about computer information systems is, do you want to do the programming or do you want to manage the people doing the programming? And that's sort of the difference of computer information systems. You will be capable of doing some programming, but you're going to be more capable of managing technology. So managing the programmers, managing the network engineers. We even have a minor in cybersecurity management, so you can actually manage cybersecurity professionals.